Hello everybody, this is Dre here. Um, as promised, I was going to do an Insider video, so here I am. And first I'm going to show you the actual product. Here it is. Um, the difference between mine and another Instyler is that this is the Instyler Pro. So I just wanted to let everybody know. Um, to tell the difference, I think that the actual Instyler has lights up here. As for mine, it lights up down here. The three lights means that it's on its highest temperature, which is 385 degrees, I believe. Yes, 385 degrees Fahrenheit. Um, this is how it looks, and this is how it works. You just slightly touch it, and it will start. As for me, I like to push it right in. Um, I do have with me a soft brush. As you can see, there's a soft brush on this side, too. So, first, I'm going to tell you what I did with my hair. Um, I washed it last night and stuck it in six braids, three on each side. Um, before I did that, I put this in it. So this is the only product that I'm working with is Wonder Aid Oil, in which I sprayed about four sprays on each side, um, two on the top and two underneath, and then just braided it up in my six braids. So it's easier for me to section and do my hair. As you can see, I've already started with one piece here which is done but I'm gonna show you the demo on the second piece here so first I'm gonna take this piece oh well first I'm gonna actually pin this up because or tie this up because this might get in my way and it might be a problem so there we go sorry about the messy hair but this is what I've my hair looks like overnight when it's in braids. So, I'm gonna pull it out in the elastic. Ah. Okay. And then a couple of things about the Instyler. Um, it does take about, I'd say, five minutes for it to heat up to its full potential. Those lights that I showed you earlier, those will actually flash um, until it's ready and then it'll stay on solid. Um, so I'm just going to comb this with my ouch, ouch, ouch. So I'm showing you the real thing, the real deal here. So that people don't think that it's fake and no, I'm not getting paid to do this. Uh, actually, I'm paying quite a bit of money for my installer because I bought it on the As Seen on TV. But, however, I have heard that they are in Walmart and stuff like that, so... I have a hair on my lip. Okay. So this is what my hair looks like after it's brushed out. Very, very poofy. Pretty thick, yes. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to section it again. Tie this piece up. I'll pin it up with the claw. Yeah. Okay. So I'm going to show you the product. I'm going to first brush it out with the soft brush just so I know that it'll be easy for the installer to go through. Make sure it's still on its heat hottest temperature. Flip it around and here we go. I have to be careful because my ear is there. So I'm going to go through pretty slowly here you can go slower though some people can go slower so I'm going to pull my hair out just to show you the difference as you can see one piece already fell and that's straight and there you have it can you go wrong with that? no um, now I normally do it about two or three times over just to make sure I'll go under this time so I can get right in there and I'll pull it there we go Oops. let go loose there it goes again gorgeous see and it makes your hair shiny I don't know if you can see it yeah again get a little bit of picture quality but yeah I'll go over it a couple times just to make sure that we have it really straight go both ways as you can see done and done 
Um, you often would think that the ball or the spinning thing would tangle your hair up, but surprisingly it doesn't, so that's good. Um, one thing I will let you know is that it's not going to make your hair pin straight. It's going to make it more, I guess, flowy. Um, it can blow in the wind, like, like this. Another thing I find is sometimes my hair gets a little staticky when I'm doing it, but that's about the only con. I love the InStyler. It allows me to do my hair quicker than I have ever been able to do it. Um, normally when I use my flat iron and straighten it, what I have to do is get out the shower, straight blow dry it, then straight, then put grease in it, and then do the actual flat ironing. So that whole process takes me about three hours to do maybe two and a half three um so that was the demo here here you have it your hair flows very nicely it's very extremely soft so i would recommend it if you don't want your hair to be actually pin straight or even just something to have on the side to be able if you need to do your hair quickly um but that was it I hope everybody enjoyed seeing that demo, as boring as it might have been. <laughs> uh, but yeah, I'll be in Nova Scotia soon, so all my Scotians, I'll see you at homecoming. And um, all my TO people, I'll see you sometime. Catch you on the flip side. <laughs> okay, bye everybody.